Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your love reading. This is going to be for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. This is a general love reading so it may or may not resonate. If it doesn't resonate with you, feel free to check your other placements. We're going to look at you and the person you're currently thinking about first and then we'll look at your overall love life. So let's see. Sagittarius are the person they're currently thinking about. The person Sagittarius has in mind what's going on between these two. Ooh, someone secretly wants to come out the cold. Someone low-key wants to reconcile with you. They want to reach out. They could reach out in a, it, they could make it seem like a friendly, like they're doing it in a friendly way, but they low-key want to make up with you or have, your, have you in their life again. You may be guarded towards this person. Some of you may be interested in them, but guarded with the swords because why did they leave anyways? Um, could be Pisces, could be Aquarius, could be Gemini, could be Taurus. Ooh, you guys like each other. The lovers and the nine of cups. You two like each other. So you're probably going to let this person write in even though you got it. Because this is like wish come true here. Lovers, you guys are going into the bedroom. You're going into the bedroom with this person. I don't care. We got the... Empress, there's a there's heavy attraction here. Heavy attraction, <laughs> Knight of Wands. This is a Sagittarius reading. You are getting back with someone, and I, I don't even feel like this is a heartbreak situation, or you guys broke up and it was painful. It could have been, but I see this going straight to the room, straight to the bedroom. It's part, either you're holding on to them or they're holding on to you, but somebody didn't let go here. So when when they show up, it's just... <laughs> it's like the attraction is there, the passion is there. It's happening. It's happening. If you're single, you could be meeting somebody and it just goes quickly. It happens quickly. The attraction is in... It's just... I can't even say much more. Let's go to your main spread. What's coming up for Sagittarius in love? What's coming up for Sagittarius? I feel like this person, especially if you haven't slept with this person yet, I feel like they secretly want to sleep with you. And I don't feel like it's in a way of them just wanting to get what they want because I even see like, let's say you deal with women whether you're a man or woman, you deal with women, um, she wants it. So it's not like, it's not like it's just a man trying to get his, it's like, it's more than that. I don't know. Let me see, Sagittarius, what's going on? There's this vibe that I keep getting of somebody wanting to be with you in the bedroom but not saying it it's just like this secret it's almost like they want to be mysterious about it and kind of seduce you but anyways <laughs> let me get off that topic sagittarius you you were on your way you you were on the verge of moving on from this person you were just moving on with your life because they were not take they were not making any effort making any moves towards you they got the knight of pentacles in reverse and they saw that you were distancing yourself as well two of cups in reverse you guys could have broken up separated mm -hmm. yeah there, there was a separation between you two but you're jumping right back into bed you view them as your weakness or it could be vice versa them viewing you as their weakness i definitely feel like there's a bedroom weakness here like it just has to happen between you two either you've had it before and it was great or you guys have never done it and you're both curious but 
this is some this is someone from the past and i don't feel like it's a ex that you're not interested in it's someone where the attraction is still heavy the passion is still heavy and it's just gonna rev back up could be a fire sign aries leo sagittarius especially leo um who else is here just leo and fire got taurus but let's see hmm. clarify the six of cups in re not six of cups six of pent pentacles in reverse clarify the six of pentacles in reverse you could have stopped putting energy into this i feel like you just felt like they stopped they stopped so you stopped you may have had a feeling that it would pick back up soon, that maybe they were just being distant for some time. Hmm. Could be a Sagittarius like yourself. Clarify the Six of Swords. Yeah, I don't feel like there's anything, there's not much negative between you two. Yeah. It's just very carefree. Like even though you were in this, you're in the Six of Swords, you were kind of moving away from them. It's not like it's like with the Fool, you would leap right back into it. It's just not one of those situations that you're actually running from. It's just kind of slowed down. Why the Knight of Pentacles in reverse? They may have been a little bit guarded, like their reason for not move, making a move, they could have been guarded or um, dealing with a past situation or ending a past situation. For some of you, they could have kids. They could also have like past trauma, like having fears of love. Like when they get close to someone, they start to fear getting hurt. Hmm, but they're running back to you. Seven of Swords in reverse. Why are they seeing Sagittarius as the Eight of Cups? Yeah, they feel like you, you stopped taking action. It's just one of them things. They stopped taking action, so you stopped taking action. And it just... But they feel like there's unfinished business here. It's, it's like you both had this idea of, hmm, let's not, you know, let's just give it time or whatever. It's just not really... It's not over, but it's not like, I don't know what happened here, but it wasn't, it wasn't like major. Why this page of cups blocking? could have been dealing with a past situation or past situation was getting in the way they needed to deal with something or end something from the past why the seven of swords in reverse clarify the seven of swords see so you both were kind of waiting for you know, you were waiting for them, they were waiting for you to say something, nobody did. So this person may be cautious as they come towards you. They may be fearful that you don't want to speak to them. They could be a Scorpio, Aries, Taurus, Aquarius, Leo, Sagittarius. But I feel like it's going to be different now. Especially if they've fully gotten rid of a past situation. What's going on with Sagittarius when it comes to love? Playfulness, unrequited love, there's enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. That could be the relationship that they were ending, their past relationship, or it could be that there wasn't much going on between you two in the past. So it kind of just fizzled out, but I see it coming back very soon. Clearly decide what you want, so it comes to you now. We have let go of control issues, allow the situation to unfold naturally. Messages for Sagittarius. <laughs> Spiritual union, two of cups. Deception and envy. Their ex could have been jealous. Positive movement forward. Tr 
triumph and success. This person could be the jealous type, fearful of deception, fearful of being betrayed, being cheated on, because there's something with them holding back, it's something to do with a past situation and them being guarded and cautious. So they may be may have been fearful of getting hurt, that's why they didn't move quickly. What are the love messages for Sagittarius? Storm warning that keeps coming out. Unexpected, yeah. It could be that you don't expect this person to show up. Anxiety and travel. Travel and storm warning keeps coming out. For those of you who are traveling, check the weather before you travel. You don't want it to ruin your vacation if that's the case. You could have met this person while traveling. They could be coming back to your town or you're going back to their town if it was a long distance. What's going on with Sagittarius? You are ready. They may have felt like they weren't ready at the time. Self-love. Heart, no, not heart to heart conversations. Honest conversations. Let go of control issues again. This person may have like issues with trying to control things. They may be afraid to get hurt, so they try to control their feelings and hold back. Sorry, it's too many cards at once. What do we have for Sagittarius? Good karma. Alpha male. This could be alpha male or female. Put in work, Aliyah, try again vibes. Yeah, they want to try again. We got financial windfall, new money, increasing finances, unexpected income, job offer, pay rise, business on the up and up. Follow your heart, it leads to abundance. You got money coming. <laughs> this person could be financially secure as well. This is this is a, a reconciliation with someone and I don't feel like it's a ex ex or a bad ex. It's just something from the past. The advice for Sagittarius say no, rest, good reputation, just stay. Okay. Long term and stability. There's something that you're needing to say no to. Or if you... If you're looking for... Yeah, wow, okay. So there's something you need to say no to. I don't know if it's you saying no to them wanting to jump into bed too soon or what. But I do feel like there is a heavy bedroom type energy with this person i don't feel like that's all they want but i feel like they want it but still be careful because they are fearful of love they are afraid to get hurt and that could be like either they had this fear and they got over it or they could be avoidant so just be careful but i do see this being a heavy heavy Attraction, passion, something starting back up here. So I hope this was helpful, Sagittarius. There is Leo, Scorpio, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Again, Aquarius, Taurus. And Virgo, Capricorn. Feel free to check your other placements if you want to know what else is happening here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.